Another developing story, the fire threat across North Texas just keeps on intensifying as fire after fire keep crews busy out there. Three firefighters were hurt trying to get one under control in Hood County. So far, this fire has burned more than 450 acres and it's about 50% contained at last check. Right now, fire crews believe the fire started from a group of workers who were welding in the area. Another fire near the town of Rome in Wise County is now contained. Our Sydney Piercing is there with a look at the damage. Good news for the folks out here in Rome. This fire is out and all evacuations have been lifted. It is fairly calm and quiet out this way. Very different story last night, though. This fire and the chaos that followed all started when a dump truck crashed into a power pole. The chief out this way said that truck was going the wrong way on Highway 287 when it lost control and hit the pole. That set off a sequence of events that not only knocked out power to 1100 customers last night, but also started a grass fire that burned somewhere between 100 to 150 acres here near Pioneer Road and Highway 287. The driver of that truck was taken to the hospital and is expected to survive. We've seen power crews out here overnight working to get that power restored, and we've also seen several fire crews out here throughout the morning working to put out any hot spots as they arrive. Important to note, we are expecting bulldozers to come out this way to create a fire line just in case that fire does spark up and spread. Out here in Rome, I'm Sydney Persing. Back to you. Meteorologist Jesse Hawila here with us. And Jesse, I've been covering these fires for a few weeks yeah. now, and they just doesn't seem like it's going to stop until we get some rain. So I'm hoping that's on the way, but it doesn't look like it from the look of your face. There's a chance of rain, but it's one of those chances where it's like, you know, 10%, 20% of people will actually see it. So the uh, drought busting rain, not in the forecast, but let me show you this. I want to remind people uh, as we talk about these fires, and we've been talking about this for weeks, the fire danger remains elevated to high across all of North Texas. We have to be extremely careful extremely careful. We've seen the smallest sparks uh, cause these fires and they will spread quickly with the winds that we have too. Do not toss lit cigarettes on the ground. If you're driving and you toss it into the median or somewhere in the, even on the shoulder uh, of, of a highway, that can roll in and start a grass fire really quickly. That can spread out of control just as fast. Do not drag tow chains on the ground. Uh, do not park or drive over tall grass or mulch for that matter. Outdoor burning is banned in every single county in North Texas. Just be careful with sparks in general, welding, anything, anything that could cause a spark or a flame. We have to be extra cautious. Fort Worth, 91 right now, feels like 97. Love Fields at 89, feels like 95. It's very humid outside. We have a heat advisory for everybody in North Texas today. Highs will be around 103 for DFW. Uh, it could be as high as 106 in some spots with heat index values as high as 107 degrees.